Hello everyone, welcome to Neil's World and this is a very small video today regarding my new light that is uh, Godox SL60W and uh, it comes with a remote and it is a pretty awesome light and it's pretty, uh, uh, pretty popular light on a budget for YouTube and for other uh, video production. But uh, many people get confused with this remote a little bit because uh, if you see this remote it, it gives uh, something like if you can see yes it get, goes to 10% the 10% is the default value of intensity of the light using the vol uh, using the rocker button available in the light light itself but sometimes uh, the remote does not work below 25% okay it is set it, it can go to 25% if it happens to you I have a solution because uh, this Godox SL60W light is 5600K temperature it is a fixed temperature uh, fixed color temperature light daylight fixed 5600k and the remote that when it come uh, when it comes from the factory in the box it normally the color temperature is set to something else so the first thing for example let me show you uh, by changing the color temperature by going to the setting menu uh, okay put the set here you can see this if you can see this set button if you press the set button you can the color temperature is blinking then you can use the plus or minus button to change the color temperature so if I change the color temperature somehow something uh, why is not working okay and the color temperature I'm changing the color temperature now if I change the color temperature you can see that automatically the uh, percentage or intensity of the light changes to 25% which is by default is happening to most of the users who, who has not tinkered with the remote uh, because the color temperature which came set in the remote sometimes is not 5600K. So it does not sync with the light properly. So first you need to do what you need to do. Go to the set menu and then use plus or minus uh, buttons to make it up to. Okay, let me go to. Okay. Set and then you can. Okay, let me. Okay go to uh, yeah let me set uh, the color temperature to 5600 then once it is set you can change the temperature down back to uh, intensity down back to okay uh, you can see that I'm bringing it down 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 and yes it's going below 25% and it is coming down up to 10% which which you can do by the way using the hardware button available on the light so sometimes it may be a bit of a, a problem if you do it using the remote because if the remote is not set properly you have automatic change of intensity of the light once you press the remote button to change the intensity so it goes directly to 25% if it is uh, not set properly so this is the way you can set this remote this Godox remote it is an universal remote which work with many different Godox light lights uh, this Godox SL60W does not have color temperature changing setting it is fixed uh, color temp it, it is fixed in color temperature so it have you have to I mean set the color temperature to the same color temperature that is there of the that is of the light so once you do that your remote will, will work properly okay so this is it this is what i wanted to uh, share today i hope you could find some value in this video if so please do like the video and do come back for my next video very soon thank you very much see you soon